Brian here with you. Welcome now into my office. Let's examine this very scarce early 20th century insurance atlas for the city of Exeter, New Hampshire, about 25 minutes away from Dover, where we are right now. This atlas is uh, survives like this. Uh, this is the original uh, plain back cover. Someone has, for some reason, excised part of it. It uh, begins with the first lettered back of this index map right here. And uh, let's now flip through this atlas. But before we do, I want to just point out the key here. Uh, talks about the types. This is because it's an insurance atlas, they got into the details of iron doors, windows, and iron shutters, what the buildings are, if they're frame, brick, stone, iron, or fireproof, where the fire stations are. All these details will be found uh, within each of the maps because the purpose of the atlas was uh, providing uh, insurance for, you know, insurance companies. And so, for instance, down here, the color key for the buildings uh, corresponds to what they're uh, made out of. And you'll notice that there are dimensions and uh, feet and so on for all of the plot lines uh, within the city. And it makes, uh, for instance, the layout of all the homes that existed at this time, they're documented here. So it's a really just a fabulous source of information. Uh, look at this, the Exeter Opera House headquarters showed motion pictures in 1913. Look at that, it's a, it was a motion picture hall in 1913. Here's a cobbler and a shoe shiner, a picture framer, a barber. All the businesses are named. Here is Exeter Academy. And evidently, as time went on and buildings were torn down, there would be an X, a pencil X, put through that building. And if a new building was constructed, it would be drawn in pencil, uh, like so. And all of these maps have, uh, are blank on the reverse. The atlas uh, is complete. Uh, and so this is the seventh map within it. Yeah, it's really just a fascinating snapshot, a detailed snapshot uh, in time for the city, the layout of the city, and all the buildings that existed right here. There's a shoe manufacturing uh, company right here, no doubt a big brick building. And here we have uh, Robinson's Female Seminary right there. There's Front Street. And this is the whole downtown, the city. There's some big, all these greenhouses. Here's Phillips Exeter, Dunbar, and Webster Hall. There's the library, Davis Library. And here's another one. And here's another one. And the final map within this atlas is right here. You see, like typical, uh, there are there's some wear along the edges, small little nicks and folds and things like this. Um, it's, it's, the, it's normal kind of wear on an atlas intended for continual uh, office use. Uh, and so uh, all examples of this vintage are somewhat scarce. And this uh, atlas is available now online from me, Brian DeMambro.